Hello quilters. Well today we're going to learn a new stitch for block four called the stem stitch and we're going to use that on these kite strings and the kite tail and and so let's get started. We're going to start, I've got my thread knotted and I've pulled it up right where I want to begin and what you need to do to start is to stick your needle in about what you want your stitch length to be and then come up back up about halfway between where I came up with the thread and where my stitch starts so that when I pull it through it looks like this then I'm gonna get that thread out of the way hold it down with my thumb take my stitch length and then this time come right back up at the beginning of the previous stitch give that a pull Do the same thing again here. This just gives a nicer smooth look to the line that we're going for here with the kite string. And so it's one that I like to use a good bit. And I'll just continue working my way across and then when I get to the other side I'll finish it off on the back like we've done in the past. Um, so give it a try on your on your block this month and see what you think. If you have any questions um, feel free to email me or contact me through my website or Facebook and also we've got a great group of gals and maybe some guys I don't think so though <laughs> doing our uh, so long for the quilt blocks and they're showing off their photos of what they're doing and their fabric choices and just a lot of fun and encouragement so I would encourage you to to um, check out our Facebook page for the sew along and come and join us if you like at any rate I hope you have a good day and happy quilting <music>